kept noise. making this noise like ree fee fee ree fee fee ree fee fee. One of them was doing that. Yeah. <laughs> It's like a little house in the prairie. It was. <laughs> oh, <laughs> baby's got a fever. But anyway. Best hoodie. Best hoodie. A buddy. A buddy. <laughs> I set a timer. I set a timer. I set a timer. Uh... Hi, welcome back to Baking with Josh and Ange. Hi, you guys. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. 2018. Wow. What? That's when did crazy. that happen? We hope you guys had a really great holiday. Yeah, yeah, we had, we had a great holiday. We went to Colorado to visit my family. It was so much fun. You guys, it snowed. It snowed like three days. Yep, and, and it was super cold too. <laughs> it was really cold, but it was so cozy and beautiful. And when it started snowing, our kids lost their minds. Yeah, that's the only thing they wanted from this trip was yeah, to snow. see, we have to see the snow. They're such like Southern California kids, like yeah. we don't get snow. And so they were so excited. They wanted to run out in the snow before they were even dressed. It was like <laughs> early in the morning, we woke up and it was snowing and I was like, you guys. No, they, they learned that lesson pretty quick. <laughs> yeah, they did. They were like, oh my God, it's cold, it's cold. So, oh, and we went tubing, which was fun, but scary, yeah. but fun. We went so fast down that hill. We were flying. I was legitimately scared. The first time I went by myself and I was like, oh my God, oh my God. But then every time I went with Josh, we like link arms, I felt better. It was a big hill. I mean, it was it was a good it's size a big hill. hill. I'm such a wimp though. I'm it was so wimp. much fun. And thank you so much to Jory and David, Josh's sister and her husband. Yes. They let us stay at their place, all five of us. Um, it was great. They have was, a beautiful, a beautiful place. So beautiful. Overlooking um, the mountains, it, it's, picturesque. I mean, it's so beautiful. But we did all share one room. <laughs> we all slept in one room. You know, we had the air mattresses and the sofa bed. <laughs> yeah. and what? We are all sharing one room. Wow. Woo! This yeah! Is. All of our kids make different noises yeah. at night. Um, let's see, we have a pretty loud mouth breather. Yes, oh, and then, um, then one of them was doing that. Yeah. <laughs> the other one rolls and rolls and they and was sleeping on like an air mattress, so it kept nice. making this noise like, <laughs> like the first night you and I looked at each other, we're like, like, oh my gosh, we're, oh my we're God. not going to get we're any sleep here. We are never going to fall asleep. <laughs> it's just that all five of us shared one room yeah. for five nights. Right. It was real bonding. It's like a little house in the prairie. It was. <laughs> oh, <laughs> baby's got a fever. We had a great trip. We, really we had a great trip. <laughs> So to kick off the new year on Baking with Josh and Ange, we're actually going to make my soup that Josh loves. <laughs> a lot of you asked about the soup I made Josh for oh his birthday. Gosh, so many of you asked about the soup. But that made me so happy. Which is great. The comments were just, uh, it was soup 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 soup, 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 soup. So the soup is really yummy and it's healthy and it's not hard to do because I make it, guys. I make it. And you know I like to cook. I'm not good at baking because baking... You're so precise. You're so precise. Well, that's true. It's you true. have to be. You have to set timers. You have to measure things out. Yeah. My neighbor taught it to me, and he's like me. We just kind of throw a little bit of this, a little bit of that. He made me say, Angela, you can't tell people just throw this and that in there. Right. And so I was like, you have to measure out how many carrots you're going to use, how many celery. You know, these uh, people need to know how to make the soup. It's the new year. We have a lot of New Year's resolutions to eat healthy. Yep. This soup is really healthy, and it's cold out, and it's so nice to have a cozy, bowl of soup Absolutely. when it's really cold out. This one's never cold. Yeah. I mean, the fact that he's wearing this, what is I, I, this? I have a little, what is this? I don't, know what this I don't is. even know. Yeah. I'm always freezing. But anyway. Best hoodie. Best hoodie. A buddy. <laughs> a buddy. <laughs> so anyway, we are gonna make delicious yummy soup today. My neighbor, Tom, is who taught me how to make this. Tom Piricello. Tom Piricello. It's an Italian wedding soup and it is delicious. It is so good. All right, Ange, you're up. I'm up. I'm a little nervous, you guys, I'm a little nervous. Um, all right, let's go. We need to go over uh, to yeah, the stove. Yeah, we're going to cut and... We're going to try. Yeah. We don't know. We don't really film at the stove, so who knows what this is going to look like. Okay, here we go. I'm by myself over here. Josh is behind camera. Come say hi. Here's my camera operator for the day. Hi. Hi, guys. I'm going to be here for moral support behind the camera. Yes, I'm a little nervous. You got this. Here I go. So get yourself a soup pot or a Dutch oven, if you will. Put it on medium. Medium heat, guys. Two tablespoons of olive oil. Here we go. Voila. Gonna let that warm up. Then you're gonna add one red onion chopped. Are you guys good at chopping red onion? Because 
I always tear up. Just kind of stir those onions a little bit, get the olive oil coated all on them nicely. Now add your celery, four stalks of celery, cut up, stir this in. This is so exciting, you guys. By the way, do you like my sweater? I love it. It's just like a big cozy sweater. It's a little owl. So I stirred in my celery, got it all nice and mixed in with the onion, and now you're gonna add your carrots. These are six carrots chopped. All right, put all those in there. Okay, let's stir those in. How sad is this? I have to go up on my tippy toes when I stir. It's pretty sad, but I do. I go up on my tippy toes. It's a good calf workout. All right, I just wanna stir all that in, kind of get it all nice and coated with the olive oil. Once you feel like you got it all stirred nicely, you're gonna let this simmer for about seven minutes on medium heat, stirring often. All right, this is looking really good right now, so it's time to add the garlic. This is two teaspoons of minced garlic. Just wanna stir that in there. All right, so you're gonna let the garlic simmer in this mixture for about three minutes, but you know, I don't ever set a timer, so three minutes, give or take. Come on, Josh. It drives me crazy. It makes him it's crazy. So easy. Alexa, set timer for three minutes. Oh. Three minutes. Now. Fine, Alexa. Three minutes, and the garlic will be perfect, and then we're ready for our next step. Okay, this is already smelling so good. So the garlic and carrots and celery onion, they are good to go, and it's time now to add one tomato chopped. We're gonna add that, just stir that in, and then we're gonna add one cup of red wine. You could use any red wine that you have, but the best is Pinot Noir, I think, because the lighter the wine, the better it tastes. I use one cup of Pinot Noir. You're gonna mix all that in. As soon as you get it nice and mixed, you're gonna turn up the heat and bring your red wine veggies to a little bit of a boil. And maybe you can have a little wine yourself while you wait, just saying, if you want. This will boil up pretty quickly, so you gotta pay Pay attention guys, you can't walk away during the red wine part. It is boiling, so now we are gonna add our kale. This is three cups of kale cut up. If you don't know how to cut kale, what you wanna do is turn it on its side, cut along the spine, and then you just cut it in small pieces once you've cut the spine off. Now this looks like a ton of kale, right? But it really cooks down. You just wanna stir it, and it will start to wilt pretty quickly. I always feel like we have too much kale and then once it wilts, I'm like, ah, I wish we had more kale. Stir it in there, get it wilting. All right, now you're gonna add roughly eight cups of chicken broth, um, whichever kind of chicken broth you like. And now I use two bay leaves. I think it adds so much taste and flavor. I love it. Mix the bay leaves in with the chicken broth, mix all of that together and you are going to bring this to a boil. It has come to a boil, so now I am gonna put it on medium low, and I am gonna cover it partially, like that. We're gonna let this simmer for an hour. Alexa, set a timer for one hour. Are you so happy, Josh? I'm so happy. I set a timer, I set a timer. All right, so now while this is simmering for an hour is the perfect time to get your beans prepped and make your meatballs. Okay, so <laughs> that's that's the moment we lost sound and Josh's heart was broken. That was a tough one. That was a tough one. <laughs> that was really tough. He's not a big cursor, you guys. This guy, he doesn't let, no, doesn't let no. the bombs keep fly. It pretty, keep it pretty clean. You let a few fly. Yeah, I was a little, a, bit, a little bit frustrated. Well, cause, because it was like later that night, kids are asleep, he starts editing. He's like, son. <laughs> <laughs> what we think happened was the, the mic pack was on Angela, the mute button got pushed. I think I was like on, shoving, you know, Mike I was shoving somehow. it in my jeans pocket and I think I, I think I hit the mute button. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're gonna be doing some voiceover for the rest of the video. Literally, there's only a minute left of this recipe, so just hang with us. Yep, we got this. Sorry, there was no sound. We're at the very end. So Josh has the video on the iPhone so we can watch where we lost sound. Right. And talk to you guys. So here, here we, we go. go. Here we go. Yay. So now your soup has been simmering for about 45 minutes to an hour. And you know, I do check in on it and I stir it every once in a while, you guys, <laughs> I do. So now it's time to take the bay leaf out, yep. take them out, and sometimes it's hard to find them. Sometimes I make Josh come over and help I do. me. I do, I oh, do. They're, they're both out, there we go. Now your beans have been cooling in the fridge. 
chilling in the fridge. You're gonna add a little red chili pepper flakes. If you like them spicy, <laughs> we do. You look so cute, by the way. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Put in your nice chilled beans there. Stir it up a little, add your cup of water, and now you're gonna bring the whole pot to a boil again. Okay. Boil again. Boil again. Now you're ready to add your meatballs. These guys are gonna cook right away. Like the minute they hit that water, they're gonna start cooking. You just put them in and mix it around. I need a bigger pot, You babe. do need a bigger pot. You need to get me a bigger pot. I'm gonna get you a bigger soup pot. Um, anyway, soup there me. you go. You're bringing the whole thing to a boil. It's looking real good, guys. Looking real good. <laughs> kind of mix those meatballs all in there. You wanna make sure they're all coated by the broth. You're gonna cover your pot and let it cook for about 12 minutes and then you're ready to go. Nice. Oh my oh gosh. gosh. I'm super excited. Here comes Josh. Oh, here comes yes. Josh. We were saying some really witty things right here oh, too. Oh, we were saying amazing things. I mean, Look at him go. He's so, saying, it's my favorite soup. Yeah. I'm saying, would you like some? <laughs> I don't know which way to turn. Do I go this way? You make some big announcements I soon, my I thumb. think too. I can't remember what we said. <laughs> I think we say we have a lot of fun stuff coming up this season. Well, I think we did say that. Yeah. Oh, then we kiss. Oh, then we kiss. Then we eat our soup. Out. Yeah, we gross everyone <laughs> out. We eat our soup. And that's it. And that's it. And there you go, delicious Italian meatball soup. That's right, and it's even good the next day. We actually eat on this soup like all week, Oh my guys. gosh, yeah. It's so good. All right. So good. So, what were we saying before we left sound? What were we saying? I don't know. We are gonna have some great things coming up. We're gonna have some collaborations, some yeah. more guests. We're gonna make some of your grandmother's recipes. Yeah, some, some, something from my grandmother's cookbook. And we promise not to hit the mute button. Triple checking sound from Triple now Triple checking on. sound, you guys. So sorry about that, but <laughs> whoops. So enjoy the soup. Let us know if you like it and if you make it. It's so good. Tag us if you if you make it so we oh, can see yeah, the pictures. Yeah. I actually, yeah. I love I, it when I you guys. I love it too. Yeah, it makes me so excited when you guys make stuff. And subscribe and like and click it a clacky. All right, bye guys. Bye you guys. Sorry about the mute button. When I go by myself, I think I'm gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> That's too drunk yeah. to say. <laughs> Isabel was like, Mom, what is in the toilet? <laughs> the boys sometimes aren't yeah, so tidy. But... Extra love, babe. <laughs> right now someone went, Bleh. Is there like stirring music? <laughs> One pound of, oh crap, what's it called? One third cup of <laughs> shredded, grated. grated. Still stirring. Still stirring. Stirring.